Afghanistan's Taliban government downgraded the death toll from a series of earthquakes to over 1,000 as fresh tremors panicked residents of villages flattened by the disaster. The latest quake hit at dawn around 30 kilometers north of the provincial capital of Herat, where thousands were spending a fourth night in the open after quakes. Disaster management officials initially put the death toll of the weekend quake at 2,053. But Public Health Minister Kalender Ibad attributed the confusion to the remoteness of the area and double reporting during the rescue effort. When whole villages are destroyed and populations are raised, verifying the affected and martyred people and the number of wounded is a very difficult process, he said, adding that 2,400 had been injured. At least one person was killed and 130 injured in the latest quake, he said. The magnitude 6.3 quake was followed by aftershocks measuring 5.0 and 4.1, but a reporter said damage in Herat City, home to more than half a million people, was minimal. Many residents have camped in tents, cars and gardens since Saturday's magnitude 6.3 quake and a series of powerful aftershocks. Volunteers have been digging for survivors and bodies from the earlier quakes which totally destroyed at least six villages in rural Zender Jan district and affected more than 12,000 people, the United Nations said. Providing shelter on a large scale will be a challenge for Afghanistan's Taliban authorities.